Hey everyone, how's it going? Deadly Duty here today, giving you a quick tutorial in the Outer World, showing you how to equip armor and weapons for your companion. Ultimately, kind of change their settings so that you can make the most use out of them. So, if you go to like your uh, kind of main menu here, where you can see your character inventory journal map, um, I, I couldn't figure this out at first, and it's actually very simple. You want to go click on your companion's name here. And this is where they have several options that you can tinker with in order for you to, to make the most use out of them. So, for example, you can definitely change your weapon here. This is 110 DPS pistol. So I'm not going to touch this because I, I, want, I want my companion to, have, uh, to be able to attack from a distance. Um, although, the melee weapon here, you can see 44 DPS. And clearly there's a way better weapon here, the impact hammer. So I'm going to put that in there. So now my companion has both the option to attack from a distance or get up close and personal. As far as armor goes, you can do the same thing. I don't really have another helmet to replace it with. But you can see here that the hibernation suit is at 3 armor. Whereas I have a mechanics overall junior grade 7 armor. So I just switched that out. And now my uh, companion is now much better. Companions can also have perks. So totally um, up to you and how and which ones you want to get here um, but this one increase your engineering skill when Parvati is in the party maybe nice thing you know minus 30% threat generated do you want to be sneaky do you want to be boisterous do you want to be healthy I personally would like my companion to be healthy so I'm gonna go ahead and pick this up and then I unlock the tier 2 thing so I'm gonna go ahead and apply this if I can here it is and then, this is actually probably one of the coolest tabs on here. It's uh, the behavior tab. Um, essentially, you get to see what skills this person has. Um, and then also the behavior uh, of how you want them to act. So you can have them follow you from a distance, medium, or stay really close to you. You can also have them uh, mixed weapon. Um, or you know, would you want them to go melee first? So I, I like a mix. I'm kind of let them decide in terms of how to to adapt to that situation. And then here mode, do you want them to be aggressive, um, or do you want them to be defensive, or do you want them to be passive? So I put aggressive so that they're always helping me out when um, I, I've engaged in combat. And you know, you can also see like their stats. So I mean, we can look at here if we take out this weapon or we put a crappier weapon in there. Range damage is 20. Then we put the better one back in. Damage thing is 22. So it's actually super cool. Um, make the most out of this tab. I think this is this is enough, for, in my opinion, this is enough customization such that you can actually um, make your companion better. But it's not detailed enough so such that it's like over overbearing it's not like a, a chore for you to do it's, it's very simple you know you have your your weapons you have your armor you have your perks and then you kind of have your behavior their behavior so super simple give a thumbs up if that helped you out sub below and i'll catch you in the next one see ya